double whiskey. It's long to get out of this slum with the luck of tonight's gems. Mm. Cheers to that. Oh. Don't tell me you invited the bastard in his better off, though. Leave him be. Evening, doll. How you been? George? Ruth? Didn't be here tonight. Not now, easy, yeah? I hear a wild roof. Back so soon, Charles. Oh, it's Friday, isn't it? You miss me. Didn't you, Charlie? Of course he did. You know what's going on about his dog? Hmm. You smell like luckies. So you are talking to me tonight, then, are you? Not being all serious like usual. Mm, it's not a choice, sweetheart. Tell you what. Why aren't you meant to be out there pouring drinks for us? Or were you just waiting for me? For a drink, I reckon. Pocket watch, three pairs of earrings, Ooh. silk handkerchief, <laughs> wallets. How many is that? Four. Very nice. Nice. I can't believe this handsy bloke I had all over me. God, if Charles saw him, he'd have another empty wallet. So these bastards get stingy by the day. Hmm. This one bloke wouldn't stop talking my ear off. So. Bloody hell, Ruth. Who's this that? A rich bloke, surely. Oh my god. This ring could be our ticket out, doll. I mean, now we have this, we could even leave tonight if we wanted. <laughs> yeah? Huh? <laughs> of course. Charles. Charles doesn't care, though. They're at the bar. I'm going to join them. You come. Whiskey, George, if you're offering. <coughs> cool, that's handsome. Same again, fella. Plenty where you're taking a liking to. <laughs> George was telling me about you and the lads and your liquor ship. Good girls out there, eh? No? Been a while, ain't they? No? Yeah. I hope to get a move on soon. I've got a sign for Dolce, I believe. Oh, yeah. What's that then? A ring. Let's cheers to that. <laughs> I 
drink. Well, that old man Charlie rest his legs. Why don't I get it down, Sophia? Go on then. believe in you, George. You don't normally tell lies. You don't want to keep doing this, do you? The work you and Ruth do. We all know you girls don't want it. I can see it. I life we don't have to live that way no more. But you and Charles married, living in a big old ass, beautiful children. You never marry a girl of my sort. If you knew what I knew, you wouldn't have a hard time believing me. I saw you take that ring. What ring? You two pickpocket every night in here. What could you possibly want from your friend's fella? That's got nothing to do with you. You work for me. I've got everything to do with it. You're about to ruin their night. And for what? Something made you jealous? Jealousy's not... No. I don't have to explain myself to you. She can't marry that man. I won't let her. And you think you take it into your own hands? Where's your morals, girl? Mm. Life don't work that way for the likes of you. Women especially mine. What you're gonna do is give me that ring. You don't wanna lose yourself this job now, do you? And none of those clients want a criminal. You'll be out on the streets if you give me the chance to tell. Listen, give me to the end of the night and I'll promise you double what it's worth. All right. Wait, not so serious now. I could say the same to you. Dorothy, Ruth, tonight's the night. Oh, I think he's going to ask me to. You know, he's going to propose. Dorothy, listen to me. Like, listen to me. Yeah. Didn't you hear me? It's time. We've got to go. Right now. Well, come on. Aren't you hearing me? We can't leave. Dorothy, I thought we always said we'd leave when we could, right? Well, we have it now. And we have enough. That ring, the jewels, the watches. All of it. Everything that we took that we kept safe for months. All of it for this very moment. We can leave now. We have to. No, no let's, let's think about this. Listen. He'll be bored to you in a few months, Dom. And with his line of work, he'll be dead soon enough. I know it. It's not safe. And it's not the life that we wanted. Remember everything we talked about. No more thieving. No more serving dirty men and their filthy habits. You don't understand. I, I haven't had my first love like you have, Ruth. You all have got left, all. And I promise you, I've given you everything that I can. What could you possibly want from him? It's not like he's done any of the shit that amounts to the care that I have for you. How do you think he can give you the life you deserve? Hmm? He can't. He don't give a shit about you. And I won't watch as you throw your life away for that fucking criminal! How dare you? How can you say that? You can't speak for him and you don't speak for me just because your love's dead. Don't reflect your jealousy on mine. You. Oi, don't talk to her like that. Charlie. No, that's alright. No, fuck you two! You don't care about her, you're lying to her! 
You're giving her false hopes of a life that you know you can't give her. <laughs> the shit I do for her. Oh, oh, sweetheart. You don't know the half of it. All right. <laughs> Is this because no one wants you anymore? Or because your husband's dead? Oh, George, leave her be. No, don't, George. You know, the day the coppers send you to rot in prison will be the day that I celebrate year after year until the day that you die. Could you? That's enough, both of you! I know side of you on, George. Acting like you don't know his real intentions. Oh, come on, Ruth. This doesn't concern you, George. Don't get involved. Dude, funny right, it concerns me. You two mares want to be where you are for, for me and Charles. Oh, and who says we want to be where we are, you eh? said you don't speak for me. Get away from her! Hey, what's happened, George just attacked her! What are you playing, eh? You you come here, boy! None of that, boys! No, don't, don't. And where do you think you're off to, miss? What's going on? You have to listen to me. That man, he's dangerous. He attacked us. We're not safe here, please. You have to help us. Oof, you know me. What are you talking about? Why are you saying that? You ruined their night. And for what? Something made you jealous. I think you've been played for a fool, fella. Eh? You gonna tell me why you hit her then, eh? Yeah, I think you get away with it, did ya? Charles, I don't no, 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 no! I don't need you speaking for him anymore, right? I know what he's done! And you know what? It don't even surprise me what of his tendencies to spell utter. I shit. told you! I didn't hit her! You've been through. I bet you're back through everything, Charles! Don't you kill you? What was Stop I? it! Stop it! It wasn't him! It's about you. You see, none of that past shit matters to me anymore. But John, no, don't, don't. I, I suggest you leave. Unless you want that bottle of whiskey across your head. Charles, is, is this your ring box? I know that could have been a better time for me to have done this. 